What's up, guys? It's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon X walkthrough. Okay, so in our last episode, we were in here, saving the day, getting the power back at Lumioa City, and now it is finally time for us to just get there. I mean, shoot, we did defeat everybody. Uh, yeah, our Fluffle finally evolved to its final stage, which is Ampharos, and now... Let's see. I don't think there's very much a, a lot to do. Except just leave and all that crud. And, uh, let's see. Got a burp. Excuse me. So, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. What do we have to do next? Now, we could go into Lumio City and just, uh, you know, visit the place and all that stuff. Or we could go there straight for the badge, which, you know, it's not such a bad idea. And, well, let's see. There's a bar right here going to... Oh, there's a Pokeball right there. Never mind. Well... Uh, I think we got one more bar here to go to, and of course we're gonna get attacked by a Pokemon because I am an idiot. Yeah. Okay, here we go. A Gibble, looking all mean and everything, and well, let's go right ahead and get the heck out of here. And let's see. Again, you're gonna get attacked by these these ground type Pokemon, so gotta have enough speed to get through this thing. All right, let's blade. Look at that. Oh, yes. Okay, so we got that taken care of, and there's nothing here. And, well, we just got to get to that little item. And we found ourselves a sunstone. And, well, now it is time for us to get to the other area right here without getting attacked by any Pokemon that may pop up or somewhere. So, go into this gray spot right here. Look at that. No Pokemon attacking us. And try not to be cocky or anything. And if you talk to this guy... Where are the folks at the Kalos uh, Power Plant on vacation or something? I don't know. But we're going to go straight forward and... Uh... Holy crap, what the hell? Hmm. The Pokemon. The flower Pokemon. The Pokemon that was given eternal life. Hmm. Okay. So that was, uh... That was something that we're gonna have to talk about later on. But that guy right there was uh freaking tall. Anywho, let's go ahead and give Rock Smash to somebody else right here because we need to get some items and we don't want to leave him behind. So let's see, where is the Rock Smash? Okay, so who else? Oh god dang it. So let's try this again. Let's try this again. Rock Smash. And let's give that to Let's see. I think we could give this to... Hold on, let, let, let me check this guy out. Actually, hold on. I think I know who to give Rock Smash to. I'm going to give Rock Smash to, for just this moment, I'm going to give it to Godzilla 3 because I do have, uh, what was it called? Uh, Bulldoze. So let's go ahead and do that. Take away Bulldoze. Again, he, he can always learn a new move. And, well... Let's go ahead, crack this boulder right here, look at this, Lizardon, I think that's what it's called in Japanese, and we get ourselves a revive, a nice revive right here, and here we have a Stardust, also needed, for more, for more money, more dinero, and another Rock Smash, hopefully we don't get attacked by another Pokemon right here, look at that, and of course we're getting attacked by a Pokemon. Okay, look at that, a Graveler, looking all big and mean and everything. I'm not going to battle it because it is not part of the agenda right here. I really am not trying to get that. Okay, so let's go ahead, grab that. We found ourselves a rare candy. And, let's see, there's nothing else right here. Hmm, hmm. Medicine, let's see. We could use this rare candy on this guy, so let's go ahead and use it to Bone Saw, because it's learning Taunt, and I don't want to teach it Taunt right there. And god dang, I really thought it was going to evolve. Ah, uh, never mind. Let's move on. We don't want to do anything else right here. So there it is, guys, going inside this entrance. I just don't feel it didn't feel, or it, it just doesn't feel like Lumio City when the power, the tower isn't lit. It doesn't, really isn't. 
I heard that Clement was running all about, doing whatever he could to make up for the lack of electricity. I wonder who Clement is. I wonder who that could be. So here we are in the northern section of Lumioi City. And we're getting yelled at. Sensei! Well, hello, hello there. It's the girlfriend. I ran after you like crazy when I spotted you up ahead. You know what? I heard Lum the power's back in here in Lumioi City. Some really bad people were stealing the electricity from the Kalos power plant. And then somebody came and stopped them. No one knows who, but they must, uh, they must be awesome. Who do you think this was? Who knows? I guess there was someone else uh, out there as strong as you, Sensei. And get this! They're gonna light the tower. Let's go see it, Sensei. It's Lumio City, most famous site. Oh, the uh, the Eiffel Tower right there? This uh, this way, straight ahead, you'll run smack into the Prism Tower. Hmm, okay. I think we need to, uh, yeah. I think we need to go there now. Let's go check this whole thing out right now. So as you can see, there has been uh, more added uh, Pokemon centers right here. I think there's like maybe six Pokemon centers in here. Correct me if I'm wrong. And here we have a Team Flare Grunt. This guy here is like, The Flaming Red Cafe is perfect for hot young stars like us. We really bloom when, it, here, uh, when we're here having lively debates about how to make a better tomorrow. So bitter, so dark, that's doing it right. Espresso is the oil that keeps our gears running smoothly. Hmm. Look at that. Remember that cafe, guys. Remember that cafe. Okay. So, let's move on right here. First and foremost, let's go ahead and heal our Pokemon because we kind of need to. We kind of need to heal our Pokemon. Let's go heal this Pokemon. We had a long battle. Yes, a long, long battle. Okay, so let's go right ahead. And there is nobody here that we know. No, we don't know him. So, let's see. Oh yeah, we're going there. So once you hit the, once you hit this area right here, it doesn't matter what direction you're in. You're gonna see Clement and his sister right in front of the gym and say, and just they're about to light this the whole thing up. Good timing, they're just about to turn on the lights. Hey, look, it's Clement. He's Lumio City's gym leader. He's good at inventing things, and he makes all kinds of devices. Though those two f uh, are my friends. Hmm. You don't say. So let's see what we got. Aren't you done? Not quite yet. I just have to check on the lighting circuit here. Ah, oh, Shana! And you are a challenger? Sorry, but could you wait a moment? Come on, Clement. Let's go. All right, everything's ready. The future is now, thanks to science. Prism Tower lighting system, activate. Okay, let's see what we got. Look at that. Oh my damn. Oh my damn. Look at that. It is lit. And, well, look at that. We did it. I think you call this feeling being entranced, right? Now, I have another great memory with you, Sensei. Excellent. My prism tower lighting system worked brilliantly, just like all my inventions. Yeah, right. Whatever. There are challenges waiting for you, you know. Prison Tower itself in Lumioi's uh, Pokemon Gym. Hmm. Come on, or Clement's inventions sure are amazing, right? He gave me uh, he gave me one that solves puzzles, but it always feels like a shame to use it, so I haven't yet. Okay, good luck at the gym. I don't need luck. Luck is for losers. That's right. Okay, so here we are in Citrico Plaza. Now we can actually do a bunch of stuff. So in this episode right here, we're just gonna... Yeah, in this episode, we're just going to take a tour. Now, one thing that will actually happen after you actually light up the whole place is that you can actually use the taxi cab system right here. You talk to this guy. He's like, thanks for choosing the Lumi cab. The base fare is 710. You want to ride? This guy will actually take you anywhere as quickly as possible. So just remember the places that you need to go to. That way you get there quicker. And I think you can actually ride the go-goats around here too. So let's see. What we're going to do right now is just take another tour of the places right here. And I think I've already been in this place. Yeah. Hold your phones. Hold your phones. Hold on. I just found someone. Let's see. 
Oh, you're that kid, the, the one who came to see me. Hey, hey. So tell me, how has the experience here been useful? You ever got about me, have you? I'm the journalist, journalist Alexa. I gather info about what's going on in Lumioi, and then I write it up. I travel the world and gather information, but Lumioi is a real stopping ground. And I don't know how to, how, I don't know the famous shops. I could tell you exactly how many Isper are in the, every one of our alleys. I know every everything about this city, so you just come to me and if, if there's uh, anything you want to know. Do you know, do you want to know, or do you want to know about Lumioi's hottest spots? Not right now. Okay, so, yeah, this is a pretty cool place right here. It's pretty, it's a pretty cool place, and, uh, well, let's see, uh, actually, we're in the southernmost, uh, southernmost area right here. We were already here, like, a few episodes back, a few months ago, or a month ago or so. Maybe two, uh, two months ago. I don't know. So what I'm going to try and do is just try and visit some spots here and there and uh well make it make it worthwhile and all that stuff now i think i said that there was like maybe six pokemon centers right here. i could be wrong maybe it's four and here we are in hibernal avenue hibernal avenue now there will be some alleyways right here where you'll be able to find some certain uh, pokemon trainers and let's see i think this place right here what is this called the restaurant Le wow i don't think you can enter that until you're like cool and everything but let's go right ahead and check out one of the alleyways right here. As you can see, we're going through the alley, and there is nobody right here right now except for... What the hell? Oh, damn. The alleyway. Just because it's a big old city. Kind of reminds me of... Uh, what was it called? Uh, what, what was that city in, in Unova? So, let's see. What place is this? Hmm... The eerie impulse that comes uh, that some Pokemon can emit. I wonder what it could be. Uh, what it is all that eerie? Do not know what that. What she's talking about? I don't even know. So let's see. Talking, talking, finding people. Will you give me free stuff? I do not know. And let's see. Mom and Dad left us behind to travel around the world all to train their Pokemon. That's why my little brother Trevor has always been dreamed of traveling all over Kalos with uh, a, Poke a Pokedex of his own. Huh, Trevor! So I'm assuming this is where Trevor's from, huh? Look at that. Okay, I didn't even know that. Hmm. I didn't even know that. Huh. Trevor is from this area, so we found his house. Alright, so let's go down another alleyway and see if we can find a trainer here. I know you guys are dying for me to battle someone. And, well, let's see. God dang it. Nope. It's just another alleyway. And... Let's see. I'm looking at big ol' uh, area right here. We can actually see the, uh, I think it's like a, a river. No, not a river. Uh, a pipeway. Gosh, if I could fish, I could find out what kind of Pokemon live in the river. Hmm. I do have, uh, I do have a rod. And, well, let's see. Is there anything else that we could find right here? Oh, would you look at that? We know who this person is, I think. I don't know. Talk to this person. And, won't you buzz off? What is this? A macho contest? I, if I fight you, will you go away? Sure. Let's find out who... Uh, let's get this over with. Alrighty. So here we go. Uh, going up against uh, the punk girl Lillian. And she will be coming out with a crook rock. And that was my first time off. God dang. Alrighty. Let's go. Okay, so again, I'm kind of like lagging right uh, just a little bit. Come on. Come on. There we go. Okay. It's the internet, guys. Okay, so here we go. Surf attack. For the win. Get that. That drain. Look at that. Okay. Okay. And Goku has reached level 40. And everything is good. Alrighty. Alrighty. Normally, I ought to leave, too. Just leave me alone next time. Hmm. Okay, alrighty. Okay, so there's a cafe right there. And here we are in Vert Plaza. And, well, let's see. Let's see. I think there's something else right here that you can actually find. Here we are in Vernal Avenue. And, well, if we go right here, this is Blue Plaza. And, let's see. If you talk to this individual, probably. Hold on just a sec. Let's see. I got lost somehow and ended up here. Isn't it exciting to go somewhere new? So, trainer, how about helping amuse a, uh, amuse a poor lost girl like me? Sure. 
Wow, getting lost led me to a to a Pokemon battle with you. Yes. Yes, it did. Alrighty. So here we go. Waitress, the waitress Paget, coming out with her Curlia. And well, let's see what happens right here. Level 30 Curlia. So I'm. No, it's not gonna evolve it into a uh, a uh, Gallade or anything. It's a female, but it's at level 30 and all that stuff. Which, yeah. Level 30 should have evolved it right now. You know, it would have been awesome in crud. And Waitress Paget has been defeated. Happy. Okay. Do people who never get lost also never lose sight of the goal in the battle either? Maybe I'll just get lost around here again. It's something trying to find you. Okay. And yes, yeah, the freaking jets right here. Good God. I probably should move to another area where there's no jets and stuff. I don't know. Okay, so that was just a few things that you can actually see right here. Um, there really isn't a lot that you can actually find, except for what you found down in the, in the southern most area right there. But after that, you know, you can actually come here, battle your tra your Pokemon uh, Gym Leader, and everything will be cool. So, I'm going to pause right here, guys. Stay tuned in the next episode. We will be battling the Gym Leader for our next badge. So, thank you guys again. I'll see you guys next time.